In this video, we are going to continue with practical applications. You will find this on page 75 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook Y equals MX plus C to success. Let's look at a practical example for sum to infinity. A small ball is dropped from a height of 1 meter onto a horizontal floor. Each time the ball strikes the floor, it rebounds to two-thirds of the height from which it has fallen. S she has shown that when the ball strikes the floor for the third time, it has traveled a distance of three and two over nine. Okay, so it comes down one. Then it's just doing two-thirds of one. It's two-thirds. But then it must go down that two-thirds. Then it's two-thirds of two-thirds, which is four over nine, and it goes down four over nine. So show that when the ball strikes the floor for the third time. Now let's, let's just think of all that light for the third time. So this is the first time, up, second time, up, third time. So it's up to there. So it will be the one, the two thirds times two, and the four over nine, and this is exactly then what I got there. Okay. Show that the total distance traveled by the ball cannot exceed 5. So what the ball do, it goes until it stops. Okay. So if it's, we're going to form a sequence. Now it's almost like that recurring decimals. So we, we first just going to form the sequence, leave the 1, and this is the recurring part. So it's going to be 2 thirds, 4 over 9, then again, remember 2 thirds of 4 over 9. Let's just show you. Oh, let's just get the pen correct. Two thirds of four over nine, and that's going to be eight over twenty-seven. Do you see? And that's multi, and then it continues. So start the sequence when the ball goes up and down the same distance. Okay. So this is the sequence. The value of R is two thirds. The value of A is four over three, and I just put it in there. And then don't forget. That, so this is the sum to infinity, but don't forget the first one. So it can become 5, but it cannot, it will strive actually to 5, but it will not go over 5. Okay, and that's how you do it. And they like this kind of sums um, to ask this in an examination. I want you to stop the video and I want you to do try now 36. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. I'm going to underline again a few things. A rubber ball is dropped from a height, it's again one meter, onto a re each time the ball strikes the floor, it rebounds nine over ten of the height from which it has fallen. Show that the total distance cannot exceed 90. So it's basically the same, but I think still it's always good if you start with a picture. So it's coming down. Okay, and let's just make the ground another color. Let's call this is the ground. Okay, so it's coming down. Now oh, I want to take that also green. Okay, and that was the that was the one meter, and now it goes nine over ten. So it will go up. Just want to put my. Okay, I will know. So every time, I need to make it a bit higher. Mm. I'm just going to do it like this so that you expect it to follow. Okay, now I can bring in my ball. So the ball is coming down, and then the ball goes, okay, so it's coming down, and then it goes up down up down up down okay so this is one this is nine over ten then this will also be nine over ten then it's nine over ten times nine over ten so and that's the 81 over a hundred so this is now 81 over a hundred 81 over a hundred and then it's 81 over 100 multiplies 9 over 10. Okay, so let's just see. 
um, 81 ABC 100 multiply 9 ABC 10 and that will then be 7 to 9 over a thousand okay 7 to 9 over a thousand okay uh, let's see this is 8 okay this one is then 7 to 9 over a thousand this is 7 to 9 over a thousand okay so if I form the sequence I'm going to do it like this it's that 1 plus then it's that 9 over 10 and how many is that 2 plus 81 over 100 times 2 plus 7 to 9 over 1000 times 2 okay so basically I'm going to if I okay so just just use this as your sequence so this is also it's going to be 9 over 5 plus this is 81 over 50 plus 7 to 9 over 500 because every time I put it goes in 1 and then 2 can go in 5 and that's why it simplify like that okay so basically I can say that the value of A is 9 over 5 the value of R and now don't forget this is T2 T1 T3 so it's T2 divided by T1 so the value of R will be that 9 over 10 and then I'm just going to quickly this is the sum to infinity because it's between negative 1 and 1 so I'm going to work out the sum to infinity which is a over 1 minus r this is not a 9 <laughs> looks almost like a 9 this is a okay so the value of a let's just get my blue uh, the value of a it's 9 over 5 1 minus 9 over 10. And then I'm just going to press this on my calculator and I will get on the dot 18. So uh, if you add the first, so if you add the first one meter, you see that the total distance traveled by the ball, ball cannot exceed 19. So therefore, 1 plus 18, it's 19. Uh, Uh, let's just say therefore the total distance traveled by the ball can not exceed 90. Okay. And that's your final answer.